in a surprising turn of events, Novak Djokovic has received a significant boost in his bid to qualify for the year-end ATP Finals. Despite his recent statements downplaying the importance of reaching Turin, unexpected results at the Japan Open have created new opportunities for the 24-time Grand Slam champion. Djokovic, a seven-time ATP Finals champion, is currently set to compete in two major events, the Shanghai Masters and the Paris Masters. While the Serbian legend has repeatedly mentioned that his primary focus is on Grand Slam tournaments and representing his country, his path to qualifying for Turin has opened up. Djokovic stated, Torino is not my goal at all. I am not chasing ATP finals or rankings anymore, emphasizing that his priorities have shifted toward more significant events and personal recovery. However, Djokovic still plans to compete in Shanghai, followed by the Paris Masters, before making further decisions about his future schedule. He said, after Shanghai, I will see what I want to do next. I need to physically, emotionally, and mentally rest before thinking about my future plans. Currently ranked number 9 in the ATP race to Turin, Djokovic's qualification for the ATP finals is uncertain. His performance in the upcoming tournaments could be crucial, especially with some top competitors ahead of him having the chance to participate in more events. Taylor Fritz, sitting comfortably at fifth in the ATP race, saw his own qualification hopes delayed after a shock defeat to rising French star Arthur Phils in the Japan Open, giving Djokovic a potential opportunity to close the gap. Fritz's loss leaves him without crucial ranking points, while Djokovic could capitalize on this and other developments. Sitting just 630 points behind Fritz, Djokovic's path to qualifying may rest on strong performances in Shanghai and Paris. Additionally, Australian player Alex de Menor, currently ranked number 8, is struggling with injuries that have kept him out of the Davis Cup finals, further opening a window for Djokovic to move up the rankings. Djokovic's position may also improve as he eyes other competitors, such as Andre Rublev and Kasper Ruud, who could slip below him in the rankings. Nonetheless, if Djokovic sticks to his limited schedule, he may have to watch carefully as other players fight for their spot in the ATP Finals. For now, Djokovic remains focused on the immediate future, with his eyes on the upcoming tournaments that could determine his presence in Turin.